Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got something super exciting to share with you. A powerful tool that's going to elevate your content creation game. Say hello to Edge TTS text to speech. Once upon a time, in a small village surrounded by mountains, il était une fois dans un petit village entouré de montagnes, une petite fille curieuse. Había una vez en un pequeño pueblo rodeado de montañas, una niña curiosa llamada Emma. Edge TTS lets you effortlessly convert text to speech with Microsoft's cutting edge technology. You can even adjust the speech rate and pitch to make the voice sound just right for your project. From dynamic narrations to soothing audiobooks with over 300 voices and support for more than 40 languages, the possibilities are endless. Perfect for your audiobooks, storytelling, language learning, and more. Here is what you can do. Convert text to engaging videos with customizable visuals. Choose from more than 40 languages and more than 300 voices. Ideal for educators, content creators, and language enthusiasts. So, whether you are a teacher, a content creator, or just someone passionate about languages, these tools will help you create captivating content with ease. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on the latest updates. Let's dive in and see how it works. Okay, first of all, let's try English one. And I'm going to in huggingface.co and spaces HTTPS text to speech page input text in here. I'm going to write a little bit story and then select the voice in here. I'm just writing US, for example, like let's change to our narrator. Okay. I'm going to select Emma Neural in here. Okay, you can change the speech rate adjustment and also pitch adjustment as well. So not like that, but I'm going to click submit button to generate this audio. Let's get just here to play this sound. Once upon a time, in a small village surrounded by mountains, there lived a curious little girl named Emma. That's perfect. And also you can download from here as well. So it's perfect if I, and you can look for the different kind of name as well. So let's have a look for different, for example, like male voice, let's submit it and let's have a look. Once upon a time, in a small village surrounded by mountains, there lived a curious little girl named Emma. One day, while exploring the forest near her home, she found a mysterious, glowing flower. That's perfectly fine. And also, I can download from here as well. The next thing, we can run this from our, actually, computer as well. So, how to do that? I'm going to go in here to files, here, go in here, in here to three dots over there and just go to clone repository in here git clone repository just copy it in here actually a uh, second choice and copy it and i'm going to create any folder in here tts name named tts and enter in here i'm going to click this here to write cmd and in here right click git clone text to speech in here and hit that enter button so that's perfectly downloaded in here so that go in inside and again i'm going to right now go to cmd and right here i need to type i need to type python and app.py and hit that enter button so as you can see we need to actually no model name it's pyts so i'm going to go to requirements over here i need to actually install these requirements so that just go to cmd again pip install r requirements.txt and when it's done again go to actually let's clear this one just right here python app py and hit that enter button so right now it's actually running from our local server 
and just in here to copy and right click to copy and go to web browser just write this one and hit that enter button and you're actually running from this edge tts to in your local actually computer right now i'm going to use the same prompt in here and also select voice again just look for different for example name and submit it and let's have a look once upon a time in a small village surrounded by mountains there lived a curious little girl named emma that's perfectly fine so let's try another language as well spanish in here let's have a look for female narrator había una vez en un pequeño pueblo rodeado de montañas una niña curiosa llamada Emma. That's a little bit so actually a uh, weird voice. I'm going to change in here different actual narrator. Había una vez en un pequeño pueblo rodeado de montañas, una niña curiosa llamada Emma. Un día, mientras exploraba el bosque cerca de su casa, encontró una flor misteriosa y brillante. That's perfectly fine. You can also download from here as well. So, the next thing, let's have a look for different try from French in here in let's have a look for il était une fois dans un petit village entouré de montagnes une petite fille curieuse nommée emma un jour en explorant la forêt près de chez elle elle trouva une fleur mystérieuse et lumineuse that's perfectly fine actually i downloaded it as well and you can listen actually um at the end of the video this one is edge tts text to speech model so if you like the video please like don't forget to subscribe and also comment down below and thank you for watching me see you next one once upon a time in a small village surrounded by mountains there lived a curious little girl named emma one day while exploring the forest near her home she found a mysterious glowing flower as she touched it the flower spoke i can grant you one wish emma thought for a moment and said I wish for everyone in my village to always have enough food and never go hungry. The flower glowed even brighter and disappeared. From that day on, the village had an endless supply of fruits, vegetables and grains, and no one was ever hungry again. Había una vez en un pequeño pueblo rodeado de montañas, una niña curiosa llamada Emma. Un día, mientras exploraba el bosque cerca de su casa, encontró una flor misteriosa y brillante. Al tocarla, la flor habló, puedo concederte un deseo. Emma pensó por un momento y dijo, deseo que todos en mi pueblo siempre tengan suficiente comida y nunca pasen hambre. La flor brilló aún más y desapareció. Desde ese día, el pueblo tuvo un suministro inagotable de frutas, verduras y granos, y nadie volvió a pasar hambre. Il était une fois, dans un petit village entouré de montagnes, une petite fille curieuse nommée Emma. Un jour, en explorant la forêt près de chez elle, elle trouva une fleur mystérieuse et lumineuse. En la touchant, la fleur parla, « Je peux exaucer un de tes souhaits. » Emma réfléchit un instant et dit, « Je souhaite que tout le monde dans mon village ait toujours assez de nourriture et ne souffre jamais de la faim. » La fleur brilla encore plus fort et disparut. À partir de ce jour-là, le village eut un approvisionnement infini de fruits, de légumes et de céréales, et personne n'eut jamais faim.